What's up, everyone? Happy Friday. Coming to you live from uh, my air conditioning office parking lot that we just plowed. Uh, we had a bunch of snow here in uh, Long Island, New York last night. Uh, I'd say it was uh, seven, seven or eight inches, something like that. So uh, the ride uh, didn't happen to snow this morning. We've been out plowing. There's the old girl there with the uh, western plow on it. And we are over here. Uh, this is the air conditioning office of family business here. Uh, HVAC contract and residential and commercial air conditioning services called over here in Farmingdale, New York. And um, I want to get to, uh, get to my message of the day before it gets too late. I'm going to try and ride. i got a little more parking lot to do. Uh, and I'm going to try and get on my bike. It might be too icy. I don't want to kill myself. It may be an inside ride tonight. Uh, let's We'll see what happens. We're definitely going to get 10 miles in. But uh, I don't know if I can ride. Uh, it's kind of icy out. And I don't definitely want to get hurt in this process because... It'd be kind of hard to ride the rest of the uh, 100 days or whatever I got left uh, hurt. So message of the day. So today I was out with my son, uh, who is nine, and I taught him last year how to use the snowblower. And he was super excited uh, to get out there and use the snowblower. Um, he was last night. He couldn't wait. He couldn't wait to get him uh, up and running. Um, he wanted to go out in the garage with me last night and get everything running, make sure we were ready. So he can come out and snow blow the whole neighborhood. And uh, he had a blast. He had a blast. But um, he also realized that it's not fun after a while. It's not fun after a while. After a while, it becomes a job. So um, that kind of brings me to the lesson of the day. Um, a lot of things in life that we want to do, we think are going to be fun. We think are going to be cool. And we think the grass is always greener. And then when we get there, it's just like work. It looks like work. It is work. Um, I remember back in the day, I was all excited to mow the lawn, get the lawnmower running. First time I was able to mow the lawn by myself, I thought that was his big shot mowing the lawn. And then week after week after week, I got stuck mowing the lawn. Um, so it's a lot of parallels in life that we're always looking for the next thing. We're always think that something's going to be better than it is. Um, and really just to, uh, not be always searching for the new thing, to uh, enjoy what we have, to have gratitude for what we have. Um, of course, new experiences are fun, but uh, they're not always all they cracked up to be. So sometimes we're not concentrating on the pe present moment because we're looking for that new thing. We're not happy sleigh riding because uh, we want to go snow blow, when at the end of the day, I'd rather go sleigh ride. And uh, snow plowing's fun for the first uh couple hours and then when you do it for uh, all day and around the clock and overnight like I used to do uh, it's not fun anymore um, so there's your message um, not everything is what it's cracked up to be um, in life you're looking for that new adventure that new thing uh, you always think this is going to be fun this is going to be better um, but it's not always better it's not always fun um, a lot of times work is work is work whether you're uh pushing a lawnmower for the first time, you're pushing a snowblower for the first time, you're driving a snowplow truck for the first time. New experiences are always fun, but a lot of times they turn back into work. They turn back into work. So, uh, I don't know if any of that makes any sense to you. Uh, that was just something I was thinking of back in the day when I thought it was fun to snowblow and I thought it was fun to mow the lawn and then uh, I thought it was fun to snowplow and then uh, it just becomes another job. Um, so anyway, my son realized that today, and it's kind of fun to see the life lessons uh, go on. He, uh, rather than come out the rest of the day and work with me like he did this morning, he decided to go sleigh riding with his sisters. And I'm happy because kids need to have fun, and I'm happy he was with me this morning. But, um, yeah, it was kind of fun to, funny to see. Uh, I remember back in the day when I thought it was fun to do this stuff, and then once it becomes work, it's not so much fun anymore. Anyway, all right, we didn't do prayers today, so let's jump on prayers. we got beautiful blue skies here. Good Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death, amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to uh, appreciate and have gratitude for everything in our lives. 
help us to not be looking for the next exciting thing because the next exciting thing could also be another job. Uh, help us to be content and help us to uh, be happy and, and help us to enjoy snow days. Snow days. Help us to enjoy everything that happens in our lives. The good, the bad, the ugly, the exciting. We need to enjoy it all and appreciate it all and be grateful for it all. The uh, bad things teach us lessons. The good things make us want to strive for more. So there's your message for the day. Appreciate you all. Um, hopefully tomorrow morning I'll get out. Uh, roads are going to be icy. I'm not sure how this is going to work. I think it's a high of 30 tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to try and ride if the roads are dry. Again, I don't want to get hurt. If not, I'll be on a stationary bike in the house. Don't worry. I'll take some pictures of the uh, of the clock so you know I'm actually doing it. We're day 221, I think it is today, of the 365-day journey. And I appreciate you all for sticking with me during this journey. And, uh, again, if anyone needs anything, I'm happy to help. Um, whether it be, uh, something in life or real estate or business or whatever you need, I'm here for you. So reach out All right, everyone. Put your head on the pillow every night knowing you made the world a better place. Fire starts fire. Let's go. Go inspire someone else to be better while you're inspiring yourself in the process. Right, everyone be good. See you tomorrow.